Nugumanova was the jewel of any tournament, but now her career is under threat. The figure skater found herself in the epicenter of a powerful scandal. The spectacular figure skater Nugumanova became a real discovery of the pre-Olympic season, but then disappeared from the radar. Elizabeth began to appear rarely at tournaments, but she did not give any signs of alarm. The figure skater's silence lasted exactly until the end of the Olympic season. Then Nugumanova gave a loud interview in which she accused her coaching staff of bullying, which provoked a loud scandal. The blocks of figure skating did not support the girl and sided with the coach. Fans were also skeptical of Lisa's words. And whatever the outcome of the investigation initiated by the street. Petersburg Figure Skating Federation, Nugumanova is now unlikely to find a place in Russian sports. In the Olympic season, Nugumanova disappeared from the radar the girl appeared infrequently at tournaments. Nevertheless, from the outside it seemed that everything was going fine with Lisa. In social networks, the figure skater's feed was overflowing with photos and videos with a wide smile, she was always positive and seemed to enjoy life. But behind the beautiful picture on the web, there was a grim reality. At least as far as figure skating was concerned. According to Nugumanova, during training in the group of Evgeny Rukovitsin, she endured harassment, humiliation and even threats all season. Lisa was not just criticized for allegedly being overweight, she was literally not allowed to ride. After the test runs, she was sent to the junior ice, where she trained on her own. Obviously, with this approach, it was possible to forget about the success at the competitions. The girl also claims that Rukovitsin personally threatened to remove her from the sport and one of the coaches of the group from this world altogether. Valentin Molotov once drove up to me and said that if I was rolling programs, he would trip me up and I would go to the next world, Nugumanova confessed to Match TV. The accusation is extremely serious, just to come up with it. In addition, Molotov did not hurry to refute Lisa's words, if he did not threaten her, then why does he not say anything? Rukovitsin is also silent. But instead of them, colleagues speak out. As soon as Nugumanova's interview came out, renowned experts launched a whole campaign in support of the coach. Some tried to kick Lisa herself at the same time. Tatyana and Adelyevna Tarasova once said, look for shit in yourself. I completely agree with her words in this situation, Olympic champion Alexei Yagudin said in a conversation with RBC Sport. The honorary president of the Russian Figure Skating Federation, Valentin Pisiv, commented on the situation particularly harshly. He decided, since Nugumanova is not a top athlete, then there is no need to mention her. By and large, I don't know her, and I don't want to talk about individual skaters. What she does and says doesn't bother me at all. Let her figure it out herself. Who is she to me, so that I can somehow characterize her, how does she act? When I was president of the Figure Skating Federation, she didn't show anything of herself. Based on the words of some girl who has probably finished speaking, should I advertise her? She's still nobody to write about. You need to write about serious athletes, not about such. She does not deserve to be mentioned on the pages of the press, Meta Ratings quotes Pissive. Svetlana Sokolovskaya limited herself to a post with a video in social networks, where together with Rukovitsin she sings along to Vasya Oblomov's song Live. Many students of both coaches left images with hearts under the post. Maker Ignatov wrote it all, we love you with all our heart. That is, not only colleagues, but also figure skaters came out in support of Rukovitsin. The list of Nugumanova's supporters so far includes only Andrei Mazalev, Maria Talalakina and some unknown former student of Rukovitsin, who has already completed her career. And although many more athletes can secretly support Lisa, there is zero sense from this. No one wants to get involved in a scandal so as not to lose their career. Despite such ardent support of Rukovitsin, they did not let this story take its course. Anton Sikarilids, president of the St. Petersburg Figure Skating Federation, announced that an investigation will be conducted. But whatever the outcome, it is very doubtful that Nugumanova will now find a place in Russian figure skating. Unfortunately, any complaints about the coaches are perceived with hostility. About those who take you to the starts, it is customary to say either good or nothing. And about those who do not withdraw, but hide behind the doors of the training rink too. 
Lisa dared to take the trash out of the hut, and now she herself will probably be taken out of the big sport for this. Even among the fans, there are few sympathizers for the girl. They don't want to believe her, they think that she exaggerated, misunderstood and was to blame for everything herself. And if she wants to ride, she must endure. Suffer a figure skater, you will be a champion, to paraphrase a well-known winged expression. But Lisa couldn't stand it. This means that it is not focused enough on the result, it is strange that she did not go to another coach and is still listed in Rukovitsin's group. Perhaps she did not find a way to peacefully leave for another club, especially since she had already moved more than once before. Who would want to shelter her now? Except under the flag of another country. There are no other options in sight. Lisa does not want to end her career. She promised that she would not allow herself to be broken and take away her dream. And I want to believe her words. Otherwise, we will lose a good figure skater. Without Ultra C, but very feminine and beautiful. Since her junior days, Elizaveta Nugumanova has stood out at tournaments with her beautiful gliding, ballet grace and magnificent spins. She took medals at the stages of the Junior Grand Prix and reached the finals of the series. She won the stages of the Cup of Russia. In general, the figure skater was promising, even if not as strong as the same Tutbird's girls. At the age of 16, she performed Zajitova's signature cascade triple Lutz triple Rittberger at competitions. Coped with another complex cascade triple Lutz Euler triple Salkow. It could be seen in the skater's arsenal in 2019. And at the age of 15, she surprised with such an unusual cascade as a triple Rittberger Euler triple Salkow. Growing up, the girl stopped showing these elements, but she still had a triple Rittberger, a triple Rittberger, a rare and very spectacular cascade. As for the Netocrats, they have always pursued Nugumanova, including juniors. Her most confident jumps are triple Salkow and double axle, there were practically no blots with them. So the return of the body to teenage conditions is unlikely to solve the problem of undercools, as, apparently, Rukovitsin believes. And Lisa understands this and focuses on skating, not jumping. It does not bring her victories, but in the absence of falls, she is really very good on the ice and serves as an ornament to any tournament. Of course, beauty is not the main thing, but the audience is certainly pleased to watch Lisa's performances. She is not at all lost against a background of Ultra C girls. Just a priori does not compete with them, but is certainly remembered by personal style and charisma. When she rides, you can see that she likes it. I like to perform, even if I don't get medals. No wonder she said that she would invite all her loved ones to the Russian Championship in St. Petersburg if she participated in it for her competitions or a holiday. However, now this holiday risks leaving the girl's life forever. Figure skating, which she loves so much, may turn out to be just a memory and even overshadowed by a scandal with the coaching staff. Shadowed by a